So what should the next prime minister be doing? What should he or she do fairly quickly, potentially in the first couple of weeks of getting into Downing Street, to try and turn this around? Is there anything that the next prime minister can do in the short term? Well, one thing we suggested today was looking at the 44% increase in motor fuel prices is they could cut 44p from pump prices tomorrow, firstly by cutting fuel duty to 20p from 53p, and then by removing VAT from fuel duty. For some bizarre reason, the government double taxes us every time we fill our cars up. And that would save households about £650 each in the remaining seven months of this financial year, and possibly longer if they retain it. And that would still have fuel taxes at a high enough level to account for the environmental harm that petrol does. So it would be a good move in terms of an immediate response to the cost of living crisis, although the Treasury would then have to find out how to fill the gap that would then be left in the fiscal accounts. Really interesting how I, 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 I'm always fascinated by just how j- j- just what percentage of the of the fuel that's put into cars is actually taxed. Almost half of it is actually taxed. There's, I suppose, quite a lot of room for the government to move there.